The open source Python package Mike.io has reached a new level of maturity with the release of version 1.0. It's now even simpler to read, write, and analyze Mike data files with context-aware plotting and easy subsetting, and using a more readable syntax. Any DFS file can be read to a dataset, which is now a much richer data structure than before. The dataset contains a data array for each of the items in the file. This DFS2 file only has one. You can plot the data array, and you can also save the dataset to NetCDF using the XArray package. The data array contains information such as the time and geometry necessary for plotting and writing new files. Also, after subsetting, you can select a single line and visualize this and save to DFS1. Let's read a 3D DFSU file with both sigma and Z layers. You can plot the surface temperature, select salinity for a single water column, and do various aggregations such as minimum, maximum, or quantiles, and save to a 2D DFSU file. Update Mike IO to version 1.0 to experience the improved workflow and new data structures with convenient, context-aware plotting and powerful subsetting and aggregation methods.